Hi, I'm Lisa from Slicker's Dog House in Padstow and I just want to show you a little bit about the harnesses that we stock in store and online. The most important thing about a harness is that we can have adjustment from the length and also around the girth. And the reason for this is that we need the length so that we can stay away from the backs of the legs and the girth will also stop that from slipping around. So this is a chest plate harness. This particular harness does up with two straps around the middle. The chest plate is the, this is the actual sizing. So where this is an extra small, these straps for the extra small will actually go down to a double extra small when they're fully adjusted. And they will also open up to quite a decent size small. Now the way to fit this particular harness is we have the wide bit at the front, we pop the right paw through that hole and we take the two front straps and we clip them round the back of the neck. What we really want is this part of the chest plate to be level with the breastbone. So you can usually feel the breastbone there, it's quite prominent. And then we take this strap around the back. Now because we have this nice and low, we can see that this is actually giving us a lot of space behind the backs of the legs, so we're not gonna get any chafing. The common mistake when fitting this harness is that we tighten this chest plate at the front and then it pulls that underneath the backs of the legs. So what we want to do is actually extend it here, sit that down level with the breastbone, and then this then sits that nice and far back away from the backs of the legs. Always keep this strap so that you can just get a thumb or a finger in there. That stops any movement because if we have movement, we have chafing and we get matting. These are available in our store in Padstow and also on our website, slickersdoghouse.co.uk.